So um, Usman is going to fight uh, Colby Covington. Kamara Usman is going to fight Colby Covington. And I got a feeling that this fight is probably not going to be as entertaining as the first fight. The reason for that is because I feel like um, it's going to be more wrestling involved in this fight than the first fight. I just got a feeling that one of them is going to shoot for a double leg or a single leg. And it's, it's going to be more wrestling. Uh, the first fight was a bit of a surprise because the fact is... Um, both of them uh, decided to uh, fight standing up and it, it did make the fight very entertaining. But after that, um, obviously, going into the fifth round, both of them won two rounds apiece. And then the fifth round itself, um, Usman managed to get the lead and managed to knock out Colby. Now, do I think anything will change in the second fight? I actually think Usman's going to win this uh, quite handily. The reason, and I could be wrong, the reason for that is is because um, obviously since their last fight, uh, Kamara Usman has got very high level wins. Obviously he beat Masvidal the first time um, on six days notice. Even though um, that was a contentious decision, he did clearly win that. Then he knocked out Gilbert Burns and then he fought Masvidal again and he managed to knock out Masvidal. So he's on a tear right now. He's absolutely dominating. While if you look at um, um, Colby Covington, the only win he's got is over Tyron Woodley. And fair play, he got a win over Tyron Woodley, but it, it didn't look as uh, as impressive as, uh, as what... F- thing was able to do so just from that perspective i just i just think it's um it's obvious that who who i think is going to win this fight um just seeing it from that perspective i think um i just think uh kamara usman is just levels above him now don't get it twisted i'm not saying colby doesn't have no chance in this fight that that's not what i'm saying but i, I just think um uh, I just think Kamara Usman's on another level. I think he's just uh, he's progressed so much in terms of his striking, and he's gotten so much better that I I just think um, that there's just no way that thing can actually catch up. Um, I could be wrong. Don't get it twisted. I could be wrong, but I just I just uh, just based on my inclination, I I just don't I don't know how uh, things gonna actually pull this off. If the only way I can see Colby doing it is if he um is if he if he was to fight him um if he goes for a wrestling wrestling takedown or something of that sort then maybe he could uh give give uh Kamara Usman some problems but we all know Kamara Usman's a decent wrestler and to be fair that's his actual base his base is wrestling so yeah just from that perspective I I just think um I think um. Uh, Kamara Usman's gonna beat Colby, and I think uh, the first fight he obviously broke his jaw, despite what Colby's been saying. Um, there's a reason why he ran out the ring and he didn't want to do the post fight press conference. There's a reason why he got humiliated the way he did. It's because Usman comp- completely destroyed him, and his jaw looked like it was hanging as well. Uh, there's a, there's a reason for that. So, yeah, just from that perspective, I just I just think there's no way that uh, there's no way that um, that actually you know what i'm not gonna go that far because obviously big upsets in mma have happened but i just just think usman is on such a tear right now that i think i'm not saying it's impossible but it's going to be very difficult for uh uh uh, for colby covington to get the win don't get it twisted it's going to be competitive it's going to be a fun fight but i just think kamara usman is going to clearly win this fight and i think it's going to be quite decisive actually so yeah that's just my opinion maybe you think uh, what i'm saying is a uh, bogus and wrong maybe you think uh, what i'm saying is just a uh, complete ridiculous but i just think there's something about levels in this sport and if you look at the high level wins that uh colby covington uh kamara usman's been getting um i just think he's on a whole other level to colby covington i feel like is everything he's been saying to some extent has been true He's he's starting to double lap everyone within the world weight division, and it, it just looks like um. I just feel like he's gonna do it again. He's already, obviously rematched the Masvidal and uh, knocked him out, and now he's coming back around and he, he's he's getting to a position where he's gonna have to fight fighters that he's already beat again, and obviously Colby Covington he's already beaten him and now he's about to fight him, again and I think he's gonna beat him again. So yeah, just from that perspective um. Uh, I I think I think it's uh, clear to see that I just think uh um 
yeah, I, I, I just don't see how I, Thingy wins this fight, apart from if he goes down a wrestling route, but even if he goes down a wrestling route, I just think, uh, um, I think Kamara Usman has got the talent to beat him there as well, so yeah, but this is just my opinion, obviously I could be wrong, and fighters are fighters, they, they always try to find a way to get the win, get the win, um, one thing I did like about the press conference was that despite um, all all the hate and animosity they have towards each other, uh, Kamara Usman did say that he does respect uh, Colby Covington as a competitor. And I, I think that's positive. I think that is positive. So, yeah, that's just my opinion. Uh, tell me your opinion. And um, obviously, like and subscribe to the channel. I've got um, a lot more content coming your way. Peace out. <laughs>